Welcome to the Civil War Digital Digest. I'm Will. As you'll notice, unlike every other episode, things look a little different today. This episode is dedicated to the officers, although enlisted men, if you can figure out how to get away with this, I think you're going to want to try it. The recipe we're making today is called Hooker's Retreat. It was written down for us by Captain Francis Adams Donaldson. His journals and memoirs were published in the book In the Army of the Potomac, the journals of Captain Francis Adam Donaldson. He mentioned this drink that was made up by his friend and marching companion, Captain Lemuel Crocker. Let's listen to it. Crocker prepared him a celebrated beverage which he had discovered and invented shortly after Chancellorsville, which he named Hooker's Retreat. It consisted of whiskey, water, and sugar, liberally coated with nutmeg. Crocker, Thomas, and I on the marches always carry these sundries so that in case of separation we can still have a Hooker's Retreat at will. This beverage soon became famous in the command. So it became famous in the 118th Pennsylvania, the Corn Exchange Regiment. We don't have a lot to go with on here as far as the mix goes, so we went ahead and did a little more research and we found How to Mix Drinks, or the Bon Vivant's Companion by Jerry Thomas, is an 1862 bartender's guide. It gave us several whiskey options and we picked one that seemed to be right in the spirit of what Crocker came up with just after Chancellorsville. So what we're going to do is we're going to mix two parts of whiskey to one part water, we're going to add sugar and then we're going to grate nutmeg on the top. To do it, we're actually going to do it opposite of what I just said. We're going to do the one part water and the sugar first. And what that's going to give us a chance to do is to do in the bartending trade what's called muddling or breaking up the sugar. The sugar in this case is a, a raw sugar that's been allowed to form into clumps. The reason we chose this is the mess chest that we're using was carried by a Wisconsin officer and the original is still in the Wisconsin Veterans Museum. When you look at the photo of the original mess chest, you see sugar very much like this. So we'll toss that in with the water. And then to muddle just means to break up. A lot of times that would be a wooden muddler. In our case, we're going to go ahead and just use the spoon because it's what we have. It'll quickly break up and we can use the flat of the spoon to finish it the rest of the way. We've muddled the sugar, mixed it with the water. Now let's go ahead. That's one part water. Let's add two parts whiskey. And for those of you who are whiskey fans, you're going to ask me, Will, what type of whiskey to use? My response is going to be a good soldier's response. Whatever you can get your hands on. We've added the whiskey. We'll stir it up a little more. Allow the sugar to mix the water and the whiskey. The final piece that Donaldson said Cracker did was he took nutmeg. We've got whole nutmeg and a nutmeg grater out of the liquor chest and we'll go ahead and grate liberally on the top. And there you have it, from the Corn Exchange Regiment, from Captain Crocker, by way of Captain Donaldson's memories, One Hooker's Retreat. Enjoy. If you've enjoyed the episode, we'd ask you to hit like and go ahead and subscribe to the Civil War Digital Digest. We'll see you next time.